My name is Todd Sutter and I drive a 2008 Chevrolet Corvette Z51. Like a diamond, you alone, you cut my heart like glass. I am a computer science major at UNO, uh, but I consider myself a businessman. I'm getting married this summer to my beautiful fiance, Sarah. So my dad's always uh, been into Corvettes, so I've always been a Corvette fan myself. decided it was time for me to get one and while we were in Minnesota visiting my uncle for Thanksgiving we saw it and ended up buying it the next day and driving it home so it's kind of spontaneous the guy didn't want me to test drive it because it was raining but I did anyway and ended up driving it home in some pretty nasty weather, but we got her home safe. So. So this isn't really a normal Corvette. Uh, there's, there's a lot of aftermarket items on it. Uh, I didn't do any of them myself, but the guy that I bought it from did updated cam and headers. It's on coilover suspension, has Z06 brakes, uh, ZR1 replica wheels. has a short shifter. And it has carbon fiber ground effects all around it, including the front splitter, and then it has a carbon fiber spoiler on the back. So the guy before me uh, used it for autocross. Everything that he put on the car was a functional purpose to get the car to go faster. In fact, he even tuned the car to 93 octane, so I have to find a Fantasy's gas station because that's the only one that I know for sure will have 93 octane. I'm not gonna race the car. I just like it for the looks and to make it look like I can go fast. But I don't actually go fast. plans to modify this car any further. It has enough on it as it is. I bought it the way I liked it. My favorite thing about the car is that I have to avoid speed bumps. I've, I've always been a fan of uh, low and slow, that's what my, my friend and I say. It's impractically low, but it looks so good that I have to avoid all speed bumps are taken at extreme angles. <laughs> so the first supercar that I would say that I've owned was a 350Z. 
and I modded that one out a lot and I had subwoofers in it and underglow and that was awesome. I loved it so much. Um, this car is quite a higher tier than that one. The car right before this I had a um, 2005 Porsche 911 Turbo S and that car was a true supercar but it, it has the twin turbos and quite big twin turbos at that. I'm much more of a fan of the naturally aspirated and or supercharged engines. This one is naturally aspirated because I, I like to be able to maybe get from stoplight to stoplight around the city quicker um, and, the, and the Porsche was really, really fast, but it was only fast at high speeds and I could never uh, get the potential out of it around town and I didn't go race the car. So I think I like this car better than the Porsche because of the instant power of the V8 naturally aspirated engine as opposed to the Porsche's V6 with turbos. I, I doubt it. <laughs> I go through cars pretty quick, so I think I'll be replacing it soon enough. I learned that one from my dad. <laughs>